Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the foe talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. First of all, I want to say congratulations to Killer Mike. For winning album of the year at the Grammys last night. I think he won three all together. Big shout out to him. But ain't the story, man. That ain't what everybody talking about. Everybody talking about one thing. Is he got arrested last night? Yeah, look at look at it right here. Mm, mm, mm. Killer Mike being escorted up out of there. Got put in handcuffs and walked up out of there, man. Look at this. I don't know what went down, but they say, look, he got into a little altercation backstage. They said he got into a little fisticuffs with security back there, man. They said he had a whole little, whole little melee back there. Um, when I first heard this, I said, yo, this has got to be a publicity stunt. Because um, I looked online yesterday, like, during the Grammys on Twitter, and they were like, yo, he stole it, yo. They said he ran off on the plug with this um, with a couple of Grammys because they said they both went to Utopia. This is from, what's my man's name? Travis Scott. So, yo, they say that's why. So, I'm, I'm looking like, yo, when I seen that, I said, oh, I said, oh, he playing with him now. He said, okay, y'all want to say I stole the album, you know, album of the year. What he win for album of the year, Michael. This right here, this the um cover for right here, Michael. The devil horn and some a halo and all this stuff. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, oh, he didn't, he even set this up. Like, oh, okay, since y'all say I stole the Grammy, I'm going to walk up out of here. But, yo, that ain't what it was. He ain't, he ain't get walked up out of there because, um... It was publicity. It was because he got into a little fist cuffs backstage. They said, I don't know who he got into it with. It was with somebody, though, man. But I'm thinking, was this a um, humiliation ritual from the powers to be, you know? Because, um, you know, Killer Mike, he be running his mouth, man. He be, you know, trying to be on that activist type stuff. So, I don't know. Maybe they say, look. Because that was, the, that was his biggest moment. His biggest moment is now overshadowed by him getting taken out in handcuffs. Um, first of all, I, I don't know, man. Maybe I'll live up under a rock. I ain't heard that album, that Michael album. For it to get album of the year, it's like, what it hits. What a, like, I don't know. I, I ain't checking for it, first of all. But it ain't coming to me either, either, you know. I ain't heard none of that on the record. I mean, on the, on the radio, nothing like that. I ain't listening for it, though, you know. But I'm saying to have album of the year, I think... It's kind of like a double-edged sword because maybe, like, rap should be getting some, some credit and stuff. But I ain't heard it. It's like, it, do it got to be pop for me to hear it? To hear it on the radio? I ain't heard this. I ain't heard this album. I ain't heard not one thing from it. Or if I did, I didn't know it came from there. Like I said, I'm, I'm old now. I don't be listen, listening to people's music, like... I don't be checking out who got the new album coming out. Who, who? I don't know none of that. I don't know none of that right now. Who popping? I don't know. Um, I heard, what's my man name? Andre 3000. Most that came out, but he came out with a flute album. Here's the black sheep. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. Dave Chappelle skit. But for real, how he went album of the year, ain't nobody heard it. That's what I'm. That's what I'm more shocked. Did he got arrested or did he had album of the year? Because like he don't be all into that that rah rah. So what he doing getting arrested? He, like I said, he known for being an activist. Now, last I heard of him was thump 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 thump. All in yo trunk. Oh, um, hold on, what's that? Um, what's that little hand signal? The run the Jews. I guess or something like that. Ball your fist up and. Him and the white boy. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. He had a little run. Run the Jews. Had some had some dope music. To be honest, I heard I heard more of that than I heard from this Michael album. And he won album of the year. So I saw like, man, how how you win album of the year? Like, first of all, congratulations. You did it. But a lot of people comparing it to, to Macklemore winning. I ain't heard none of this album, yo. I'm gonna go check it out. I'm gonna go check it out now. I ain't heard Utopia either. I don't listen for that. I don't listen to the rappers with, with braids and colorful hair and stuff like that. Like, <laughs> not not calling Travis Scott um Lil Yachty and all them and who say yeah 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 I'm back to the bone on that bad and bougie that little dude Lil Uzi all them little 
little corn rolls and mm, I'm too old, man. I still listen to Ghostface and Red Man shit like that, yo. Some Busta Rhymes. I think probably the newest music I listen to probably had to be Gazelda. I told Virgil right brick on my brick. Some of that type of stuff, yeah. Um, the last album I bought at the store was Damn by Kendrick Lamar. I bought a physical copy of that. So that's like the last time I purchased music. That's how that's how that's how that's how far I'm I'm, I'm not with the music now they got going on. I ain't heard none of Drake new albums, him and Twenty One Savage, none of that. Listen to that stuff, man. I don't know, man. Maybe I'm old, not the loop, but I don't see how you won rap album of the year and only. I ain't, I ain't never heard the album. Like I ain't no critic or nothing like that. Like it got to come to me and I got to hear for you to win. I just ain't heard it. It ain't popular enough. Like if you hearing a like, oh shit, I heard that before. I heard that before. On the radio and stuff like that, and then they went album of the year. You can be like, okay, cool, cool. I, I can feel that. But this man just came out of the blue and he won three Grammys. I guess that's the the accolade you want to to achieve, and you know, once you get a certain status of music, and he won. So big shout out to him for that. I ain't taking nothing from him. I'm just saying I ain't heard nothing from it. Um, maybe if you won a BET award or something, maybe I would have saw that and. Caught wind of it. I don't even know when the album came out. It, this is what this February, so you got to be rap album from last year, from 2023. I don't, I don't know, man. You getting it? And damn, this Black History Month too. You be doing all that little activist type shit, Killer Mike, and you know all that Black Power and all that shit. And you getting the rest of them Black History Month at the Grammys, at the White Man Grammys for um. Win an album of the year. I don't know, man. I ain't the one to be. But yo, we definitely gonna be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. Right here on this channel, I go live with my co-host, man. We talk about stuff like this. Um, hit the like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you gotta hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through, join the conversation, and holler at your boy. Heist man the folk. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinions. This is a dangerous group. Is it groups that we're dealing with now? All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.